Former Top Gear presenter Jeremy Clarkson, 62, has been very vocal about his distaste for light aircraft flying over Diddley Squat Farm. However, a new report has now revealed that the farmer narrowly avoided a major accident occurring in the skies above his land in Chipping Norton, Oxfordshire, on August 4, 2022 at 2.55 p.m., the two light aircraft were maneuvering around 3,000 feet above the eastern edge of Diddley Squat, where his hit Amazon Prime video show Clarkson's Farm has been filmed. One of the pilots claimed to investigators at the UK Air Proxport that he believed the person flying the other aircraft was looking to maneuver over a noteworthy property when the near-miss incident occurred. The pilot recalled that he was flying a single-engine DA-40 Diamond Star aeroplane northbound towards Chipping Norton at the time. James Corden branded most obnoxious presenter by director he then spotted a twin-engine DA-42 Diamond Twin Star make a hard, steep left turn, turning straight for them. Radar data has since confirmed just how close the planes were to colliding. Data shows the two aircraft were separated by only 100 feet vertically and around 300 yards horizontally at their closest point. Details of the incident have now been published following an investigation by the UK Aeroprox Board. The single-engine pilot claimed he was flying northbound and had passed the Cotswold town of Charlbury when he noticed the other aircraft flying approximately three miles away. They then remembered seeing the twin-engined aircraft make a turn, heading straight towards them. The plane then quickly descended and turned right to pass underneath around 800 yards east of Jeremy's famous farm. The Aeroprox report states the DA-40 pilot opined that the DA-42 pilot was looking to maneuver over a noteworthy property, as it approached the eastern boundary of Diddley Squat Farm. Don't miss! Tom Parker died without a written will leaving his wife only £70,000, Insight, Brawless Ashley Roberts suffers wardrobe malfunction in risque outfit, Picks, Sue Radford enjoys best day as she shakes off daughter's claims, Latest, the twin-engine aircraft pilot has since reported that he was carrying out a test on a commercial pilot license student and were unaware they had come so close to another aircraft at the time. The UK Aeroprox board concluded that safety had been degraded but added that there had been no risk of collision as air traffic control recordings showed the pilots were able to see each other and were therefore able to maneuver away sufficiently to avoid a major incident. It comes after Jeremy was outspoken about his views concerning planes flying over his farm routinely. In the second series of his farming docu-series, the Grand Tour host joked about setting up a surface-to-air missile battery on his land due to the increasing number of light aircraft passing overhead. He said, they're here all the time. I think if I shoot one down it won't stop them, they'll just think it was an accident. But if I do two or three, word will get out in the flying community and they'll have to spend time with their wives. Back in 2019, Jeremy also ranted about the noise pollution from aircraft flying over his Oxfordshire property, claiming in his Sunday Times column, tens of thousands of people have had their days ruined by the noise.
day.